good morning grade 6 how are you fine okay time for english unit 5 lesson 3 and 4 practice and reading time now with practice time grammar how often how often بمعنى كم عدد المرات how often بتستخدم لعمل سؤال الإجابة بتاعته بيستخدم فيها كلمات once a day twice a week three times a month four times a year يبقى لما يكون عندي جملة وفي نهاية الجملة دي كلمة once a day أو twice a week أو three times a month أو four times a year يبقى أنا هنا بعمل سؤال بيبدأ بهاو أوفن يعني كم عدد المرات وطبعا الزمن بتاعها بيكون هنا في present symbol for example she visits the dentist twice a year she visits the dentist twice a year يبقى السؤال بتاعها How often does she visit the dentist يبقى الجملة بتقول She visits the dentist twice a year يبقى السؤال بها How often How often does she visit the dentist I brush my teeth once a day I brush my teeth once a day يبقى السؤال how often do you brush your teeth? How often do you brush your teeth? تمام؟ How often do you get a haircut? ده سؤال إجابته I get a haircut once a month. I get a haircut once a month. يبقى سؤال How often do you get a haircut? How often do you go to a restaurant? ده سؤال كانت إجابته I go to the restaurant twice a week يبقى لو جات لي إجابة بتقول I go to the restaurant twice a week يبقى السؤال How often do you go to a restaurant? في كتاب المدرسة بيقول لي Listen and repeat then practice with a partner Practice time. How often do you visit a museum? I visit a museum four times a year. بعمل السؤال how often والإجابة عليه. How often do you visit a museum? طبعا هنا استخدمنا do في السؤال علشان عندي هنا subject بتاعي plural يعني جمع. ولو subject بتاعي singular أو مفرد بستخدم الفعل المساعد. بعد how often does number one you get a haircut twice a month يبقى لو أنا قلت how often do you get a haircut how often do you get a haircut تبقى الإجابة I get a haircut twice a month I get a haircut twice a month number two she take medicine three times a day how often does she take medicine? How often does she take medicine? She takes medicine three times a day. She takes medicine three times a day. Number three. He feed, feeds the birds once a day. How often does he feed the birds? How often does he feed the birds? He feeds the birds once a day. He feeds the birds once a day. Number four. He meets his friends twice a week. How often does he meet his friends? How often does he meet his friends? He meets his friends twice a week. He meets his friends twice a week.
Number five, you take the underground five times a week. How often do you take the underground? How often do you take the underground? I take the underground five times a week. I take the underground five times a week. Number six, she bake bread once a day. How often does she bake bread? How often does she bake bread? She bakes bread once a day. She bakes bread once a day. Number seven, they take a math test three times a month. How often do they take a math methods test? How often do they take a methods test? They take a methods test three times a month. They take a methods test three times a month. The last one, he gave a speech four times a year. How often does he give a speech? How often does he give a speech? He gives a speech four times a year. He gives a speech four times a year. Now, with reading time. Dear Sarah, I'm 13 years old and I have a big problem. My little brother is a pest. He follows me all the time and always bothers me and my friends. He goes into my room and takes my things without asking. My mom tells me to be patient because I'm older. It's not fair. What can I do? Going crazy. Dear crazy, your little brother loves you very much and wants your attention. Spend the time with him. Tell him he can use your things, but he has to ask first. Help him find some friends and don't forget he will grow up. Sir. Okay. Now listen and circle true or false. Number one. Crazy is 13 years old. Crazy is 13 years old. True. Number two. Crazy is younger than her brother. Crazy is younger than her brother. False. Number three. Her brother bothers the, their mother. Her brother bothers their mother. False. The last one, her brother borrows her things without asking. Her brother borrows her things without asking. True. Now, read the question and read the passage and write the answers. Number one, what is crazy's problem? Who can tell me now? What is Crazy's problem? Yes, very good. Her brother is a pest. He bothers her and her friends. He takes her things without asking. Okay, now you have to complete the answers by yourself. Now your time. Ask your classmate write the names and circle yes or no. كل واحد فينا هيختار صديق لي وهيكتب اسمه وهنبدأ نجاوب أو نعمل الجمل مع بعض. For example, number one, take medicine once a day. بنكتب تحت النيم اسمنا وبنختار yes or no. تمام؟ Try to answer by yourself. Now with the review. Listen and circle the correct picture. Okay, listen carefully. Number one, cleric. Good morning, the Egyptian Museum. 
How can I help you? Hi, do you have a special exception today? Yes, we do. It's an exception of old photographs of Cairo. Are there any tours? Yes, tours are at 11, 2 and 30 and 5. Thanks for your help. You are welcome. Huh? What is the correct answer? Yeah. B. Okay, number two. Hello. Are you ready to order? I think so. I will have a bowl of chicken soup. I'm sorry, we don't have a chicken soup today. We have garlic soup. Oh, I don't like garlic. Mm. What's spe today's special? Spaghetti and meatballs. Sounds good. I will have spaghetti and orange juice. Okay, spaghetti and meatballs and a glass of orange juice. I will be right back. Huh? Yes. Number B. Number three, baker. Hi, can I help you? Yes, please. What kinds of pies do you have? We have lemon, peach, and cherry. How about apple? I love apple pie. Sorry, we are out of apple. Oh, how much are the cherry pies? They are 10 pounds each. Okay, I will take a cherry pie. Great. Hmm. The answer? A. Okay. Number four. Mr. Sammy. Hello. Hello. May I speak to Mona, please? I'm sorry, she isn't in right now. Can you take a message? Sure. Who is calling? This is Mrs. Dua at the New Cairo Library. We have sports in Cairo now. Is that a book? No, it's a video. Okay, I will give her the message. Hmm, what is the answer? Very good. B. Number five. Sammy. Hi, Karim. Karim. Hi, Sammy. How are you? Fine, thanks. How are you? I'm good. How is your family? My mother and sister are sick. I'm sorry to hear, to hear that. What is the matter? They have the flu. Oh, is your brother sick too? No, he isn't sick. Good. Well, I will see you later. Karim, okay, bye. Hmm, the answer? Yes, C. Okay, sukkar is dirty. Now, listen, read carefully and write the correct day in the space. You have to answer by yourself. Word time and focus time review. حنقرا الأسئلة ونختار احنا هنكتب في المربعات الصغيرة always أو usually أو sometimes You have to answer by yourself <coughs> Now with the homework Workbook Practice time Look and write هنبص للجدول اللي قدامنا ونشوف كم عدد المرات اللي بتتعمل فيها الحاجات وبنجاوب على سؤال هاو اوفن في الجزء اللي تحت في نمبر 5 ونمبر 6 احنا هنكتب السؤال والاجابه reading time read the following passage and answer the following questions your time read and check when do you do these things هنشوف الجدول وهنشوف احنا بنعمل الحاجات دي في أي وقت morning or afternoon or night في exercise B read the questions and write the answer but do try to answer about yourself thank you for watching and listening
गुड बाय